Hello everyone. Long time no see. Um, how is everybody doing? Ah, uh, yeah. It's been a while. I can only really apologise for that. Um, this video is a bit of a small life catch up because it's been a while since I've made a video. Um, so, yeah, what have I been up to over the two or three months that I've not been posting? Um, honestly, it's been great. So, I am going to be making a video on this, specifically about this topic, but I started pole fitness. Um, found a local club that has a pole on it, and I have been loving it. With my disability, I have been... Learning how to do dangerous and dumb shit on a pole. Being fun. Um, obviously, I've been doing TikTok and Instagram and stuff like usual and Patreon there. But th this has been a while since I've done anything for. And I just feel sorry for that. Now, one of the other reasons, as well as me going out to this new club, um, is... I recently met a partner at said club. Uh, I met an amazing, amazing woman, um, and been spending time with her. Um, I'm not going to go into our relationship if I'll speak to her about it, and it may be something that we do a video on. Um, but as of the moment, I will just say, I've got a partner, she is amazing, she has been in one video, or two videos, I think, so far, um, on TikTok, um, just random videos, and we've got stuff planned, but I don't know how we feel about sharing our relationship online, um, so yeah, that's all I'm going to really say about that topic, but... I've been spending a lot of time with her, um, helping her with, again, life bits, as well as kind of spending some time with myself. It was my birthday uh, three days ago now. I can't remember. Um, so, yeah, it's three days uh, since my birthday. Been pretty cool. Um, I didn't make a birthday vlog again. I just haven't been thinking about YouTube, to be honest. But I will do a, a Lego haul, I think. Um, that'll be on my other video, uh, obviously. That's the other thing, is my Lego channel. Like, I've also just completely forgotten about that. I started a mini video series reviewing Ninjago City Markets. And just stopped that after the first episode, because it was meant to be a two, three-parter. Um, but my old phone... By the way, got a new phone, um, because my other one broke while doing pole fitness. Um, fell out, the screen just completely gave up, so... Yeah, I got a new phone, this is the first YouTube video on the new phone. Fancy. The new phone and stuff, so I shouldn't have any more storage issues, um, because I've updated the way that I do everything, so... I, I should be fine. Should be. Should be. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna try and do a couple of LEGO live streams. Um, obviously it'll have to be on this channel. Um, but I've got three LEGO sets. Again, I'm gonna save them mainly for, for my birthday, but I'm thinking about doing the LEGO Dreams set as a, uh, as a live stream and have you guys join in with the decision on what I make, because you can, like, the entire gimmick of the theme is you can build multiple things with the set. Again, that will be mainly LEGO channel stuff, but I can't go live on that channel, so I have to be this one, and it's complicated. It's complicated when you're not a big YouTuber, because, like, I split myself up into multiple socials, but I can't do everything that I want to on all of my socials because I either don't meet the right re meet the right requirements or stuff like that. Um, another mini life update is since getting my new phone, um, I've only been posting about one video a day. 
Um, I just on TikTok. I mean, um, that was mainly because I needed to go back and get drafts and stuff sorted. But honestly, since finishing college, I've not had any ideas for YouTube videos or TikTok videos or I mean, photography. I've had plenty of ideas for. I've photography has been one that's been popping off, been pretty poggers. And what I'm going to do, because I'm getting very hot, is, uh... Yeah, photography-wise, I've had plenty of ideas, but I've also had a very big backlog. And just not been posting my ideas. Because, like... I'm still mainly on my Lego photography side of things. I've had a bunch of ideas and start to branch out into, um... Transformers photography. Um, with the Fall of Cybertron figures being released over the past year. I've been collecting them. I've got all of them that have come out so far. I want to do a video about Cliff Jumper. Specifically Cliff Jumper because it is so annoying all the stuff that's gone wrong with him. Um, but again, I'll probably do a video specifically for that. Probably on this channel. Um, simply for the fact that it's not Lego. That's another thing is I've been very unsure about what page to post my Transformers stuff on. Because it's not Lego, I don't really feel like I should be posting it on my Khaki Bricks account. But because it's not me, either in cosplay or my day-to-day -day life, then I also don't feel like it should be going there. So, I could either go for the more general side of things and just say, oh yeah, it's photography, it's what I've been up to. Or, whether or not I should go toy photography, toy, Lego kind of thing. So I've been posting it on both accounts anyway, is the general gist. I don't know why I overcomplicated it. Um, so yeah. What does this video kind of mean? Pretty much nothing, to be honest. Um, so I've got MCM Comic Con coming up in October the 27th to the 29th. Which is going to be amazing. Going to be meeting Stephen Amell, Green Arrow, the legend himself. Um, so if any of you guys are going, be sure to hit me up. Let me know. Be cool to meet you guys. Um, I still haven't organised my uh, con plans for cosplays. Because hopefully I'll be able to test out a new cosplay that I have worn once. And I still need to fit to me because it's a little bit big. But this cosplay is of Invincible. However, the mask that came with it didn't mask. It's the headband and like the, the face bit, but there's no goggles. So it's just me in a really weird helmet kind of thing. Um, so I've ordered myself some Spider-Man lenses that I'm going to be transforming into a set of goggles to wear with the outfit. Um, as well as some other bits, like boots. Um, I've got a nice pair of boots coming for the outfit. They're the, they're the blue Invincible boots. I don't really know what to say about the boots. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, that suit is one that may or may not appear at con purely for the fact that it's a possible pain in the ass to do because it's also a bit baggy for me um i need to do a bit of repairing on it um like since getting it i've worn it once and there's already a bit of a split in the glove um and it's a bit baggy on me so i'm gonna need to have some adjustments made um so yeah there's obviously that side of things has been um the, the 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 new suit has been interesting so far. Nightwing, I'm going to be repairing this week uh, to hopefully take with me the week after, um, as well as I'm hoping Doctor Strange, just because he's quite a warm suit and it's late October, so it's going to be quite chilly. So probably Doctor Strange and maybe Miles Morales, because my the Amazing Spider Man suit. My Tasm suit has started to do a weird thing with the back zip. Because I'm so hench and buff, the zip will be like zipped up. Like the zip thing will be up here. But it will split the zip open in the middle because 
it's annoying like that. Um, it's lasted me quite a while, so I'm not too fussed about it. And I was planning on doing a battle damaged version of that suit anyway. So what I was going to do is order the exact same suit that I ordered last time. Um, but with my current suit, I've got a spare mask, which I've broken the lenses of. And I'm going to cut the thing open and decorate it like that, being damaged and make it look like I've been beaten up, essentially. So, um, future plans, obviously, Comic-Con video, and I want to try and get more active on YouTube, because I have really hated the fact that I've not been posting as much as I have, uh, as much as I used to, and I really got hit by it the other day, when I was like, damn, when I was balancing full-time college course in electronic engineering, I was still able to make daily YouTube videos for an entire year. But the minute that I finish college and have all the time in the world to focus on this, I just bin it. I just completely forget about it. It sucks. But, you know, that is the way things go. Um, as I said, I will be trying to fix that, correct it over the next couple of months. And, um... Or well, hopefully not months, hopefully next couple of weeks. Um, obviously I can't promise this week I'll get into a schedule of any kind. Because um, I need to build up with TikTok again, because I want to focus on TikTok again. Because I've really been struggling mentally from TikTok. Because the content that I'm seeing on there is absolute shit. No offence to the creators. In fact, a lot of creators that I follow... Are doing amazing. There's a couple of videos that I see that I get sent or are just on my For You page that I do really enjoy. But a lot of it is shit at the moment and it's doing so well. And I... I just... It might just be me finding it. But like, I have not been too happy with the platform as of late. I've been losing followers. So part of the reason that I only did one video a day was... Because obviously the phone broke and I I needed time to catch up with myself kind of thing and catch up with drafts. But another reason why I wasn't too quick to jump back into the two videos was because I didn't know if it was the quality of the content that I was putting out that was bringing me down. Because before I broke my phone, I was losing followers. And I just thought, oh, you know, maybe I'm pushing myself too much, you know one video a day, but one good video a day would be the better. So I swapped over to the one video a day, and my views per video have been about the same. So, uh, yeah. I'm not encouraged to make videos at the moment, because I feel like I'm being held back by TikTok. They're actively making me lose followers. And, you know, the, the the platform's just not in a space that I'm very happy with currently. And, again, I might be the only one. I might just be salty about it. But, yeah, I've not been too encouraged to post there. Um, but the thing is, I still enjoy the content that I make. Like, I, that's why I still make videos there at the end of the day, but... Yeah, this is going into a bit of a TikTok run, which, again, I might do as a future video, um, because it's, it's quite a big topic that I'm going to get into. It's a lot of behind the scenes stuff regarding that. Like, I've been offered a couple of things from TikTok, which I find a bit dodgy considering the fact that they have been limiting me. Um, so yeah, I, I think I'll... Save a full explanation for it for another video. For this video, life's been going great in my personal life, but my creator slash professional life has been pretty much going under. Um, I mean, I say that. I feel like my creator side has been stunted since college. But... You know, I'm going to keep on pushing through it, 
at the end of the day, this is what I chose. This is what I'll do. Um, but yeah, I, I hope you enjoyed um, this random catch up video. If you did, feel free to leave a like, subscribe, all of that usual stuff. And I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching and goodbye.